Okay, so this app is uh, actually by Duck Duck Moose, and this is called um, Word Wagon. And uh, this is all about, we have a bunch of different levels up here, four levels. So level one is letters, level two is phonics, level three spelling one, level four spelling two. Uh, we can open this up here and watch a nice animation. I'll let you watch this. Once upon a time, there was a big tower, and way down at the very bottom of that tower lived a little mouse named Mozzarella. You can call me Moz. Moz lives under the Eiffel Tower, which is in a country called France. Okay, so that's an introduction into your character. You see more apps if you want. We can start with level one. I love cheese and pickles. I love red chocolate souffle. Okay, and uh, keeping this in. This is my best friend, Coco. In the Duck Duck Moose tradition, everything is very nicely done, very nicely drawn, and very well put together. Uh, this is originally for the iTouch or the iPhone. We've got it on the iPad. And the idea is as you go through this, let me take you to the main screen where we have all. You can change it to capital letters or lowercase letters, and we have different categories uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, or all of them combined. And uh, let's go ahead and turn that music down one second. And as you click on these categories, you go into that. So we're on level one on letters. So if we click around on the house. the house, this is going to be around the house. Now, as he goes across the screen, you click on the object. Drag the letters to the right place to spell a word. And you have to drag the letters into the boxes to spell the word. So G let's give it a go. L-U-E-G-L-U-E. Glue. Great job. I love using glue. I'm going to go on to the next one. If you don't want to do the next one, he will quite conveniently jump over that. Pick an object from the conveyor belt. And as you go through, if you press the heart in the top left, it'll say you've completed one word. So let's go ahead and complete a few words here so you can see what happens. Now, you can put the letters e. in out of order if you want to. I, B, B, I. B. Bib. Cool. <laughs> we'll just complete this, uh, just so B. I can show you the next a part B of y. this app. B. A. B. Y. Baby. Excellent. <laughs> okay, so when you get a certain amount right, what happens is you get a star. Now, if you click on the star, you get to play with the constellations. Great job! You have stars. Put the stars in place to make an animal. All right, can you uh, figure out what animal that may be? I'm, I have no idea, but um, maybe a whale or something? I don't know, but let's, let's go ahead and have a look. So drag the stars into place, which again is, is beautifully done. The stars going across the screen. Look, it's a rat. Well, that was very close to a whale. Um, however, it was a rat. Anyway, so that's how the uh, how that works with the stars. And you press to go back down, and the star disappears. Click on the next word, and so on. Let's go back to the home screen. And you can do that for all of those categories. I'm obviously not going to show you everything right now. And, of course, you can... Turn the music back on if you'd like that. Let's turn that back off. But let's go to level two and look at phonics. And click on, let's look at all, all, words. all on, on phonics level. So as he walks through the house, we click on the thing. F-I-V-E-I-V-Five. Cool. And away he goes. Do a couple more like this to give you the idea. It's very neat how the background changes uh, as you, as he moves through the house. M L. And again, you don't have to do this in order. Obviously, if your child is 
learning to spell, they would probably I want to do this K in order. M -I -U -K. Milk. So we're on the phonics Fantastic. part here. Very nice sound effects. L T H I G U I T Light. Excellent. And there we go to get our our star. And uh, let's go ahead and see if we can actually find the whale. I'm not quite sure that's going to be a whale. Great job! Let's you have stars. Put the stars in place to make an animal. It's a cool. Horse. It's a goat. It's a goat. Okay. So you get the idea. That's a lot of fun for the kids to explore. If you look in here, it tells you what you've accomplished, which is very nice. You can click on the objects to get some sound effects. You can go back out. And let's go back into the main category and go up to the next level. So next level is spelling one. Let's go ahead and look at the vehicles. And we're not going to go through this as far as the cars go, but let's uh, let's just see what this is. Now, what you notice in spelling one is that there are no hints in the box. So you're actually spelling the word. Bike. Okay. Bike. When you touch on it, you have bike. Tweet. Tweet. Pickle pie. <laughs> and you'll notice that she gives a hint I. of the next letter if you touch her. Bike. Tweet. 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 K. Okay. E. And so on. B. I. K. Bike. You did it. And it goes through that exactly the same way. Let's go back out and have a look at level four. Uh, let's go up to spelling two and let's pick. Uh, Moz and Coco. Moz and Coco. And let's see what we get out of this. A uh, pair of shoes. Hmm. Okay, so I think more advanced words are certainly what we get. And um, again, this is for children that obviously are learning to spell or know how to spell. So shoes we have to spell. Now, oh. if you put it in the wrong place, it oh. won't go. So they oh. can learn by doing that. They could be, so what comes next? And then S -E -O. they would do that way. E -S -O. Shoes. Yay. Do you like my shoes? And we'll show you one more. Let's see what he has here. And again... Tweet. Touching e, the e. birdie, we'll show you the hints. Tweet, tweet. And you touch them twice for second and third and fourth and so on. Why? So we tweet. should touch her three times. Tweet. Tweet. Oh, tweet. Maybe I'm totally losing e. the plot, but S. anyway, she helps you to solve uh. the problems. Z I. And if we look Great at the book, job. we can see all the things we've got right. These are my eyes. Do you like my shoes? And I think you get the idea. So let's go back out from here. Oops, my mistake. Let's go back out to the main screen. And there we have all the levels. So you can just basically touch this to go from level one to level four um, to play with the app. But this is uh, another uh, really, really good app from DuckDuckMoose changing the, uh, I'll just show you very quickly, changing the letters to the capital letters, how this works, and now they're all capital letters, so that's that's how that part of the app works, and we have a star to play with that you can uh, go ahead and build Great. your animals. But we'll go back out, I uh, hope you enjoyed that demonstration, but um, another really good app by Duck Duck Moose, and it's called Word Wagon.